Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have Seven of Swords in the reverse. And this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. Okay, so this is an energy of somebody who is, um, I'm seeing things are being revealed to you. Um, this person may have been, um, you know, it's like this person is feeling like they're ready to be more honest with you. They're ready to, to show their true selves to you. This person is ready to take off any mask that they may have been wearing and just be vulnerable, open. Um, I do see somebody here is the true colors are coming out with this energy. Um, so this person is being very truthful, um, direct with you. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this um, Scorpio. Okay, so the first card we have is the Eight of Swords in the reverse and this is air energy next we have the two of pentacles earth energy virgo taurus capricorn energy and finally we have the three of pentacles earth energy again okay so i do see here somebody is really freeing themselves from um some sort of this person may have been very um an, in a state where they were overthinking being too analytical and being very careful about how they present themselves to you they may have been wearing a bit of a a mask trying to you know present the best version of themselves and i do see this as being very confining and it's like this person is now gaining the confidence to present their more authentic version of themselves they're taking off that mask this person is being more open feeling more free with you it's like this person feels like they can be more themselves with you and um they, they, they there's no more pretense so this person is definitely freeing themselves from um this box or these limitations that may have been keeping them from um, letting loose with you um, so this person is definitely um, seeing things more clearly they have this desire to collaborate with you they want to um, create something with you and I do see this person coming to the realization that authenticity is a necessary component to build something that can be stable and long-lasting so this person is definitely um, opening up more with the hopes of being able to build something more solid more structured with you um, also with the three of pentacles there's something about the work environment this could be somebody who you 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 may connect through the work environments or something about working together on something is very significant with that three of pentacles um, this person I, I do see that this wasn't an easy decision um, there is something about them needing to get clarity on something make a decision with that two of pentacles but i do see them ultimately deciding to to um to lower their guard to take away the pretense and be more vulnerable show their more authentic self in this connection and um free themselves from any limiting beliefs because they do i i do see them really wanting to build something long term with you something um stable and long lasting so let's clarify these cards um scorpio Okay, so at the bottom of the deck we have the lovers 
and this is Gemini energy so you could be dealing with a Gemini okay so again with this energy I do see people who want to this person wants to be uh, raw with you they want to be vulnerable with you they want to be open um, they want to show you their true authentic self they feel safe enough to do that now and they do feel like this is a very significant connection they feel a strong um, soul connection here there's something very different about this connection for this person they do feel like it's it's fated it's divine and it could really yield something long term and um, they are feeling safe enough to be naked vulnerable with you this person is trying to deepen the intimacy between you guys so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this scorpio okay so the first card we have is the seven of swords in the upright this time next we have the high priestess pisces energy so you could be dealing with the pisces and next we have the four of swords in the reverse air energy okay so this person is feeling like they can open up i do see somebody who was very restrained it's restrained in the beginning they may have been keeping a lot of their feelings to themselves keeping things very private or hidden um this person feels like they they can now um free themselves from this uh secrecy or having to keep things to themselves because we do have the eight of swords in the reverse um which speaks of feeling free, feeling, you know, like you can uh, open up and um, I do see them wanting to reveal things to you. This is someone who may have been keeping things very private or keeping secrets. Um, I do see this as them keeping secrets about themselves. Um, it's just them not really being their truest, most authentic version of themselves. Um, this person is ready now to to be more open. Um, this person is ready to, to, to put themselves out there to risk having their authentic self be rejected this person it feels like this is a connection that is worth um them risking that they are wanting to be truthful uh this person up until this point they've been very um strategic about how they go about this connection they've been um very um specific about how they present themselves i do see someone who who's trying to look composed or um putting on some sort of mask you know not really being their authentic self and keeping their emotions hidden or keeping them to themselves but um this person is ready now to be more vulnerable okay so i'm going to pull out an oracle card for you scorpio So the card says, the energy is gaining momentum, waxing moon. Okay, so this person is definitely feeling ready now to be more open, to be more themselves. And um, I do see them, um, you know, it's like this person may have been showing themselves layer by layer, but they are ready now to, to just fully expose themselves with this energy. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you, Scorpio. So the card says honeymoon enjoy the bliss of holiday time together okay so this person is definitely starting to feel more relaxed in this connection um i do see it. this person it's almost like they're they're letting their hair down being less uptight being more open and allowing themselves to enjoy this connection giving themselves to the connection without too much restraints is what i'm seeing so this person is starting to feel uh you know comfortable in the connection um there, there is a lot of emotions with this energy as well okay so i'm going to put another card for you um scorpio Okay, so the card says pansy sweet thoughts pray you love remember and they are pansies that's for that's for thoughts okay so i see this person as wanting to really um 
deepen the connection on an emotional level but i see them wanting to increase intimacy with you um, with this energy they really want to um, make things more intimate they want to enjoy you on the intimate level and um, they have sweet feelings towards you they, they this person is really starting to want to um, give more of themselves to the connection especially on that emotional level they want to be more vulnerable and open to it and um, they want to let you in on their thoughts their their inner world they want to really um, be more intimate with you okay so that's what i'm seeing for you scorpio i hope you have a really really good day scorpio bye scorpio